Hello class! Welcome to today's math lesson. Today we are going to be learning how to multiply by 3. And I think that a good place to start would be to practice skip counting by 3. Let's take a look and sing our skip counting song. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24 and 27, 30, we're not done. 33, 36. Try that again with me. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24 and 27, 30, we're not done. 33, 36. Good job. Let's take a look at multiplying by 3. Here on the board, I've written 10 groups of 3 equals. We have a symbol that means groups of. So when we're writing a multiplication problem, instead of writing groups of, we can write an X or the multiplication symbol. 10 groups of 3 equals. Hmm, if you have 10 groups of 3, do you know how many you have? It's 30. Let's take a closer look at some other multiplication problems. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 groups of 3. Let's count them by 3. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24. 8 times 3 is 24. 8 groups of 3 can be written in a couple of different ways. We can say 8 groups of 3 equals. Do you remember what 8 groups of 3 equaled? You're right, it is 24. We could also write it this way. 8 groups of 3 equals 24. Let's look at another question. Let's count how many groups of 3 we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 groups of 3. Well, let's count our groups by 3. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. 6 times 3 is 18. We just looked at 6 groups of 3. 6 groups of 3 equals how many? You're right, it's 18. We could also write this 6 groups of 3 equals 18. How many groups of 3 do we have now? Well, 5. Let's count these 5 groups by 3. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. What about 5 groups of 3? 5 groups of 3 equals 15. We could also write this, 5 groups of 3 equals 15. How many groups of 3 do we have now? We have 3 groups of 3. Well, let's count these by 3. 3, 6, 9. 3 groups of 3 is 9. We just looked at 3 groups of 3. 3 groups of 3 equals 9. We can also write this 3 groups of 3. 9. I want to try one more. It's kind of a tricky one. What if we don't have any groups of 3? Then we don't have anything. 0 groups of 3 is 0. That was tricky. Zero groups of three equals zero because we didn't have any groups of three at all. Zero groups of three equals zero. Class, I hope that you have some time today to practice playing with math. 
Find some little objects and put them in groups of three, and then multiply by groups of three. Before we go, I would like for us to sing our song again. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four and twenty-seven, thirty, we're not done. Thirty-three, thirty-six. Have a great day, class, and don't forget to have some fun playing with math. Bye-bye!